Hello and welcome to Reutlingen, which is to the south of Stuttgart, a very cold January day. Two degrees centigrade at the moment, and this is the hottest it's been all day. But it's a lovely, clear, blue sky. And uh, it could be great for photography, but when you film things, there may be some rather dark patches in. So I'm sorry about that. I have warned you up front. It company's called Fisher. This is called Bonito. 489 centimeters in length. I lived in a VW T4. That was a Cartago conversion, or Malibu conversion, I should say, and uh, or Cartago as it was then. And that was just a touch smaller than when I'm inside. I think it's roughly the same size, but it didn't have many of the features which I'm going to show you here. Right, well, the, f the first bit, obviously, uh, was somewhat similar. We had a, a captain's chair. There was all this space down here to sort of move around in. But what this has got here, it's got this electric fridge. So that comes up like that. Same as I've got in my motorhome and same as in many, many others. Um, if you want to stop mold forming, you put, the, put that across the vent. Uh, here, gas... Uh, and sink from Dometic, quite large ones actually, because uh, often we see much smaller things in vehicles, uh, camper vans. Uh, shower, it'd also be an outside shower. Of course, you want an outside shower, you've got to open the uh, open this. When I say shower, I mean, I really mean to say it's a, um, oh, I've forgotten the word in English. This happens all the time with me. It's one of these, what do you call that? A tap, sorry, it's a tap. Tap hot and cold water. Mine only had cold water. Your electrics are up there, Truma, uh, uh, gas heating. I suppose you could have diesel, even gas, gas for the cooker as well. And uh, you've got up here two plugs, you've got your normal plug, and there's a 12 volt one. And up here, you can see how well your uh, house battery, your habitation battery is doing, and you can even charge it from up there as well. Now, we've got lots of storage cabinets around here. And here we've got this ledge and you can sort of stick uh, books and uh, things, uh, beer and uh, dog food and all sorts of stuff uh, down there. Height clearance inside is approximately, I would say, about 183 centimetres, approximately just six foot one inch if you want it in, if in the United States. There's a table. We'll see how that works in a moment. And as an option... You can have two tables. There's your stalk for your table down there. And there's the stalk for the second table. This is the bed. We'll see how that works in a moment when it comes to demonstration time. Okay, right. Uh, toilet, what about that? Well, I suppose you'd expect it to be down there. You've got a lot, lot of space under the sink as well. And uh, I'll just demonstrate this actually here as well. Let's have a look round the outside, the back. Okay, here is a 20 litre water fresh water, 20 litre waste water, you can increase that although it is slightly limited for increasing uh, the amount of uh, water carrying capacity. You've got these two things here, which uh, come out, there you are, like, like drawers. You've got the outer ta outside table here and uh, should you want to get into there when, when you're inside, you can do it like that. There's a space to get your, your carrots out or whatever you're storing in there. Gas, you can get two five kilo canisters in there. And if you want, you've got a tent up here, comes out and that will go around the uh, door, which is currently open. Awning up there from Fiamma. How much does it cost? Well, it depends on the options you take, but you're probably looking at uh, 65,000 plus, but uh, you know, it's on the VW T4, T6, sorry, and uh, 
those vehicles are particularly expensive and particularly so with a high roof as this one here has got. This Bonito, do you think it's Bonito or do you think it's Phil? What do you think? That's Spanish by the way, Phil means open. <laughs> Close the door, you can see it like that. Good, so what do you think of this van? Write your comments down below. And now let's go over to the demonstration.